3.4 and now 2. If you're sitting in Mike's seat, you know this guy just doesn't make moves. He just got a hold of a lot of chips. You're just not going to expect him to give them away here. I'm all in. Wow, he's gone all in here with that weak ace. It's time for a giveaway at WPT Global. Free 50 bucks added to your account to the first 100 people who sign up. Simply follow these three steps. Go to WPTGlobal.com slash YT, make a new account with bonus code YT73, and deposit at least $1. That's it. $50 will be added to your account, but act fast, only to the first 100 people. Sean Harry. So Harry calls the hand. Tyler out. Now Mike with an option. No, he doesn't raise, so we're going to see a flop. And the flop is a king, queen, five kings for Mike. They both check. Oh, and a 10 comes off. Harry has made it straight. Now there could be some serious action going on right now, Vince. There's the bet by Mike, 400,000 after slow playing his kings. He now has an open and straight draw to go with him. If Harry raises here, he can win a monster pot. Vince, he just calls. I can't believe he doesn't raise with two flush draws out there. Going down to the river, let's see if it'll Oh, and now the ten of spade comes off. About the worst card Harry could see. Possible flush, possible full house out there now. But he still has got a straight. Well, Mike has checked, and Harry is going to bet. He just bets 375000 How much? This is a bet that I'm guessing is going to get paid off. Call. And Mike does pay him off. Yep. But I can't believe that Harry wouldn't raise that on the turn. Think of the size pot he might have won, Vince. Could have been much bigger than this. Finally, you hit your draw, huh? <laughs> hit a gut shot. I can't hit open-handed with a flush draw. I told you, when you have less outs, when you have a lot of outs, you're not going to get it. When you have less outs, you hit it. You hit it twice. <laughs> well, there's your logic, folks. <laughs> Action on Tyler. 240. He's got ace deuce. He's going to make it 240 to go. And Mike right behind with a pair of sevens. Let's go to 760, he says. Harry out. And he's done very well. Three betting with these mid pairs. I'm all in. Tyler goes all in, Mike. I call. And a call. Well, Tyler shaking his head. This is the first time he's four bet, period. Come on, hold up. Tyler Kenny, his tournament life in jeopardy now. Must get some help if he wants to keep playing. Ace, Bob. Yeah. Ace. Ace. Well, he's got comfort with his girlfriend, Jordana, no matter what happens. Come on, one eight. Okay, and here comes the flop, and it's a jack nine five on the flop. And his girlfriend Jordana sweating with Tyler right there. Let's get it. Together they own a fashion boutique. Just a measly pair of sevens out in front. Yeah, Tyler needs some help, or he's gonna be going back to the shop with his girlfriend Jordana. Here comes the turn. Can he get lucky here? Well, it's a three of diamonds. Well, that gives him a wheel draw, so a four gives him a straight. I can, have, I can have a four or an ace. Wow, give him more out. Must catch an ace or a four in the river. Otherwise, Tyler will be our third place finisher. Well, Vance, we're at the Bicycle Casino. Can he hit a bike on the river? That's the question. The river card coming up. Mike looking cocky and confident. Can an ace appear? No. Nine of diamonds on the river. Well, that's going to do it for Tyler Kenny. Played great poker all week. Bad job by me. Very nice living room playing the game. He just picked two bad spots to make moves at this final table. I wish I didn't make that shot. I know. Fantastic I know. effort by Tyler Kenny. Going to take home 213000 for his efforts here. Let's go see what he has to say. In hindsight, bad shove. Bad shove by me. It's OK. I wasn't on point. And because of that, I'm not going to be holding up the trophy. 
but I played really well this whole tournament. This is a great moment, you know? Well, there you see the chip counts as they start the heads-up battle. Mike Escondary with a huge chip lead over four to one. He's got 15.4 million. His opponent with 3.5 million. Harry Aratunian. It's only appropriate these guys are playing heads up for the title. They came to the final table with the two chip leaders. They're the last two players left. Harry first. He's got King Jack of Diamonds. Raise. And he will raise to 275. Mike going to okay. slop around with a 5-3 of hearts. First flop is an ace, queen, deuce. With two diamonds. Notice Mike has a gut shot wheel draw, and he's leading out in betting. 275,000, his opponent with a flush draw. He's just calling. Straight draw versus flush draw, and both of them get their hands as the four diamonds comes on the turn. What a card. Vince, this will be a double up for Harry, is my prediction. One guy's got a straight, one guy's got a flush. Well, Mike is bet 575. And Harry just calls. Well, this is going to spell doom for Mike. Well, the board pairs aces. Well, even though there's a possible full house and a possible flush out there, to get a pat hand playing heads up, you're going to bet. Mike does so. Bets the straight. How is Harry going to play the flush? I'm all in. All in. There's your answer. He goes all in. Now, even though there's better hands that could beat you, and this guy doesn't fool around much. Exact count, please. It's just hard to lay down a pat hand playing heads up poker when you're using both cards in your hand. Yeah, 1.8. I call. 1.9. Flush. Call. He does make the call. Oh, wow. I got a, I got a wheel. <laughs> With that board and the way the guy raised all in, you know, you might have to rethink it. The momentum changer right there. Harry doubles up on deal number one of the heads up battle. Nice hand, Harry. Magic card on the turn. Magic. Magic card. Magic card. Only card. It's the only card you're going to get paid off. Only card. It's the only card you're going to get paid off. Wow. That is going to make both of our hands. Wow. Well, things turning around, apparently, for <laughs> Harry. Only one out there. That's the only card. Well, there you see, Mike Escondari down to less than 12 million. His <laughs> opponent, Harry, now has 7 million. All right, the Andes are going up, Mike, to 25,000. Blinds are 1 and 200. What excitement happening here at the Bicycle Casino in Los Angeles. And this time, Mike picks up ace high on the button. He's going to raise it, makes it 475,000 to go. And Harry's going to call it with a 10 8 of hearts. I'm feeling so good about that last hand. Certainly going to prospect here. And the flop is a 10-8 ace. What a floppable Incredible event. Can you believe this? Wow. He's got two pair, and now he is going to lead out into the pre-flop raise events. There's a raise by Mike. So he's raising it to 1.1 million. And he's thinking to himself, why would this guy bet out before, take the play away if he really did have a hand. This time he does have a hand. And he's gonna raise him back. Make sure I've left there. 3.4 and now, two. Vince, if you're sitting in Mike's seat, you know this guy just doesn't make moves. He just got a hold of a lot of chips. You're just not gonna expect him to give them away here. I'm all in. Wow, he's gone all in here yeah. with that weak ace. I call. So Harry's gonna make the right call, of course. Harry Aratunian could possibly double up in back-to-back -back hands. Well, Harry knows he could take a commanding chip lead in this heads-up battle if his two pairs stand up. On the other hand, Mike Escandari can take this title home right now, put his name on the trophy. Let's see the turn. Five of hearts not helping Mike. Mike must catch an ace, a seven, or a five to win this tournament right here, right now. CBK people on their feet. River card coming up. Here it is. It's a king of diamonds. Vince, an incredible tournament event right here in the first two hands. The heads up play. The crowd is stunned. It's not over. It's time for a giveaway at WPT Global. Free 50 bucks added to your account to the first 100 people who sign up. 
Simply follow these three steps. Go to WPTGlobal.com slash YT, make a new account with bonus code YT73, and deposit at least $1. That's it. $50 will be added to your account, but act fast, only to the first 100 people. It's going up to 50, blinds at 125, 250, here we go. Mike has got the button, and he squeezes out a very strong ace-queen. Going to raise it to 500,000. Harry looking down at a 9-7 of clubs. And he wants to see a flop, so he makes the call. Let's flip some cards here. And a flop ace, king, 10. Yeah, big for Mike, hitting aces. With the straight draw. Nothing for Harry. Harry checks. Now Mike is reaching for chips. They both check. The fake, Vince. Yes, I love the fake. It's the fake he's going to check, so it's going check, check. Back onto the turn. Now a jack comes off. This gives Mike the best end possible, the ace high straight. But a four flush for Harry. Well, Harry checks. Mike is now getting out betting chips, this time for real. 375. Now, Harry has a gut shot straight draw, but it won't do him any good, of course. But the club will do him a lot of good if he hits it. So he's going to make the call here. Looking to catch a club where he could win a big pot. Now the board pairs kings. Harry not hitting. Harry not going to try to steal. He checks. Yeah, he's just waving the flag and say, you take it. Harry's playing the board. Little million bet by Mike. And Harry says, ah, oh, unfortunate. Or not, maybe. Well, maybe he's thinking if he raised it, he could win this pot. Thought about it for a second. There's the CPK gang chanting away. I wonder if they all live together. Well, even though Mike <laughs> won that pot, he's only up to about five million. Harry still with a nice chip lead. All right, he's got 14 million in chips right now. Action's on him. He has a key four. And he has just called, and Mike with an option. He's got queen seven. He won't raise. So we're going to see a flop. flop is four what a flop it is. Queen four deuce. Mike has flopped top pair and checks. He's going to try to set a little trap here for his buddy. And Harry with second pair obliges him. He's going to bet 250,000. Yes, but Mike had something in mind. And that's the raise with his top pair. Makes it 875 to go. I'm all in. Will Harry get the memo? No, apparently not because he's going all in. He has gone all in, Vince, and now you're wondering if you get trapped here or not. Oh. Oh. He's going to call. He's going to be so happy when he sees the guy's hand. Ah, oh, he has it. I got it in good. Harry just accumulated all those chips and now, and one instant could double up his opponent with middle pair like this. Far a heart, baby. Oh, man, I thought he was on the flush draw. Spite. Oh. I thought he has a flush draw. He doesn't even have a flush draw. He was bluffing. Now Mike with a great shot to double up here. He's out in front with the two queens. On, King Ball. Will the lady stand up? King is back. to come. King Harry would bay. love to hit a four or a king at this point. Can he do it? Ace of diamonds on the turn. Mike still out in front. Harry a long shot to knock out Mike at this point and take hold the title. King or a four. Not to be a deuce of diamonds on the river, Mike. Well, just incredible. High fives all around for the CBKers. Why not? He's back in it. He's officially CBK, the comeback kid. He's our chip leader. Let's get back down to the heads up action here. Harry looking down at a pair of jacks. What a nice hand. Local cash game player, former pizzeria owner, loves his hand. Blinds 153, and he's making it 600,000 to go. Now a quick call by Mike with the 6-4. Now 
Now flop queen nine nine. No help to anybody. Mike quickly checks and Harry checks his two jacks. Now an ace comes off. Another bad card to come up if you have two jacks. Again, Mike quickly checks. And again, Harry checks. Trying to control the pot. Now a seven comes off. Mike knows the only possible way he can win in this pot is to bet at it. And he is reaching for chips a million and he bets. He's got guts. But he got jacks wired. Do you lay it down? No. Not this man. He's making a good call. Good call. Well, Harry says he's been watching all the episodes in the history of the World Poker Tour. Obviously, he's been watching some great players make some great calls. Well, put him on the list there. Well done. And that's his group right there. I was like, really? You're trapping me all the way on the river? You're giving me too much credit. Fucking deuces is a nuts to me. <laughs> Mike, the blinds are going up to two and four hundred with a fifty thousand dollar ante. And look at this, Harry, with a queen jack. Not going to raise, just calls. And oh my, Mike has picked up the weapons of mass destruction, the pair of aces. And he just checks, also, Vince. Of course. He's afraid to raise his opponent out of the pot, wants him to try to catch something where he can make some money. That's what you gotta do sometimes, and he gets an ace on the flop. Just a dream scenario. Monster hand. Here comes ace, eight, deuce. Can't imagine he's gonna bet, though. Nope, it goes check, check. And the nine comes off. Gets Harry an inside straight draw. Well, Mike is reaching for betting chips now, 400,000. Harry's never gonna put him on one ace, let alone two aces, man. <laughs> Way it's being played, sure. Just assume the guy would raise if he'd had ace before the flop. Well, Harry's called it, hoping to hit a straight, but he hits a queen. Well, he might think queen's the best hand the way this hand's been played. Action's on Mike once again. He's going to put a stiff million dollars out there. Well, Vince, this is exactly what he would bet if he had a six seven in his hand as well as the three aces. Harry knows that he's going to pay him off with two queens. Mike throws down the three aces, winds up his crowd. I would have called, I would have called way more, Mike. What's that? I would have called way more. Hey, yeah. And he says he would have called more, Vince. We'll never know, but how did I get away? I believe that's to try to put his opponent on tilt a little bit. <laughs> They're very close in chip count right now. Harry's got 9.7. Mike with 9.2. First place prize, 576,000. <laughs> Become a legend of poker, just like the great Doyle Brunson did 10 years ago at this very same tournament. Action on Mike. This time he has a very dismal looking 8 4. He's getting out raising chips. He didn't raise with two aces. Why not raise with the 8 4 offsuit? You just never know with this guy. Curry's not going anywhere. He's calling with Queen 5. And here's the flop King 8 3. You know, good flop for Mike. He's got middle pair now. Harry's going to check. And Mike. Well, he was going to bet this flop whether he hit it or not. So he might as well bet since he hit it. 800,000. And he's going to take down the pot as Harry goes away. That's why they call you comeback kid, buddy. CPK gang looking happy as their man Mike coming back. It's time for a giveaway at WPT Global. Free 50 bucks added to your account to the first 100 people who sign up. Simply follow these three steps. Go to WPTGlobal.com slash YT, make a new account with bonus code YT73, and deposit at least $1. That's it. $50 will be added to your account, but act fast, only to the first 100 people. Let's get back down to the heads up action here. Mike still has the lead with 10 million, and he's got the button and the action. He's got ace four. And it looks like he's got to pop in a little raise. Yeah, just a little mill raise. I'm all in. And all in over the top with a seven by Harry. Playing with fire. Yeah, playing with fire. Mike, he's laying that Mike down. Both well, both players show each other an ace. Well, I'm not sure Harry should have shown Mike that ace. Good lead up. <laughs> just going to make him feel better about laying that hand down. He knows he couldn't have the best <laughs> game with an ace four. Okay, and with that pot now, Harry has 11 million. Mike about 8 million. All right, let's go on with it. Harry, this time with the button, he's got an ace eight of hearts. 
I bet he hasn't even told his wife yet that he played this tournament or is at the final table. He said, I want to surprise her and let her watch it on television. What a surprise this will be. How can he hide all that money till then? <laughs> He's got to raise it to 1.2 with ace-8. Mike behind him with an ace. Let's take a look. A seven. All in. And he's going to go all in. Well, he's going all in with his a seven, exactly as Harry did the last hand. I call. But Harry's making the call this time, and he's got him dominated. All right, ace eight versus a seven. Same hand. Oh, a seven. Well, you wish it was the same hand, but what you really wish for is all big cards to come up where you can split this pot. All that one time. Come on, one time. Both players saying one time. It could be one time for one of them, that's for sure. Can Mike hit a seven? No. Jack three, deuce, all the flops. Clubs, club, club. Not good for Mike. Put a club, though. Just put an eight. End it. Eight. Eight. Eight, eight. eight. eight of diamonds. End it. Eight of club for the sweat. <laughs> now he's probably going to have to hit two running clubs or a seven to win. Can Mike get out of this? A ten of diamonds. Not good for Mike. Harry out in front. One card away from the it's championship, over. Mike. Mike needs a seven to win the pot, a deuce or a three to split the pot. Nothing else will do. Go into the river. Can Harry become the next legend of poker here at the bike? Look for more jumps, Vince. Look for more jumps. He's done it. There they are. Crowd erupting. Harry Aratunian, the local, is our champion. Good game, good game. Good game. And he's still jumping, Vince, and why not? What can I do? Well, that's going to do it. Harry Aratunian has done it. He's won the first WPT event he's ever played. Unbelievable. He certainly is. Let's go talk to him, but first let's talk to our runner-up, Mike Eskandari. The cards were not cooperating as much. He was running pretty good. And every time he was catching his hands and I wasn't catching my cards, most of the pots that I won, if you see it back on TV, you see it pretty much I win it with absolutely nothing. But I had a great time. I'm happy with the way I played overall, and hopefully I'll be back again. And now let's talk to the legend of poker champion, Harry Ardunia. <laughs> professional playing in your first ever WPT event and you won one of the most prestigious poker tournaments in the world the legends of poker give us your thoughts right now I don't know what's happening <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm in total shock my family doesn't know that I was playing <laughs> I love you guys all gotcha. I won oh. <laughs> in addition to your five hundred seventy six thousand dollars you're gonna get a season ending entry into the WPT World Championship you're also going to get a customized set of monster headphones yeah. and a beautiful oh. Ublow watch. Yeah. Let's see the watch. Whoa. Yeah. Oh in addition to that, oh. you get your name inscribed on the WPT yeah, Champions that was Cup. That my dream, to have my name on that cup. Yeah. That was my dream. Congratulations one more time.